great lick. That's um, what kind of woman is this, buddy guy? Okay, so here's the deal with this one. Okay, so starts with the open six string. <laughs> that it has junk on this chord E7. Now, how do you find the E7? So go to C in the open chord. If you don't know this one already, then you put your pinky down in the third fret of the third string. C7, okay, C7, D7, E7. So my third finger's lined up with the seventh fret there. First finger lined up with the fifth fret. One, two, and on the seventh fret of the sixth string. Here's what we have so far. One, two, and down, down, down. Okay, now, then we go with our first finger on the fifth fret of the fifth string, and we go up one fret at a time. So frets five, six, seven. Fingers one, two, three. Here's what we have so far. Okay, awesome. And now, beat number four. Fifth fret, fifth string. Seventh fret, sixth string. Four and. So here's what we have. One, two. There you go. That And now, that's a great lick in and of itself. So I would kind of recommend, so you get that down, maybe practice that as a vamp, as a tape loop. It's kind of cool. Okay, now, second bar of, of the Buddy Guy lick. A7. So then it goes fifth fret, sixth string, and then chunk on A7 chord. Okay, A7. That's the caged E position. So, in other words, if you have an E major in the first fret, open chord, you lift your third finger. And now you have a barred version of that in the fifth fret. So full bar, fifth fret, third finger on the seventh fret of the fifth string, second finger on the sixth fret of the third string. One, two, then we go to the seventh fret of the fifth string, then up to the fifth fret of the fourth string, and we go up one fret at a time. Five, six, seven, okay, fingers one, two, and three. Five, six, and seven on fourth string. So here, one, two and okay beat number four that's the real funky part so it's um fifth fret fourth string seventh fret fifth string okay here's that whole second bar one two okay and then the whole lick repeats so here's what we have Okay, so that's enough, okay? I mean, if you can play that, there you have it. Now, I figured just to give some more information, some fine points. So one of the things about this tune is it deals with alternate picking, okay? And also on a more global level, I really high, highly recommend for anyone, don't make your right hand strumming and picking random. You, want, you really want to be in control of that. You want to be good at it, okay? I can show you at the end, I'm going to show you a little trick of like how you could kind of exercise around on that. Now for the picking, it's got all down picking except for three up picks. So watch, down, 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 up, down. I'm sorry, that's wrong. Down, 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 up, down. So... <clears throat> when we were doing that chromatic fifth fret, sixth fret, seventh fret, down, up, down, um, and then down, down. So down, 
down, down, down, up, down, down, down. Okay, so in the first bar, only one up pick. Second bar, down, down, down. Now, down, up, down. And then on beat number four, it's down, down, up. So down, down, up. So beats three and four. Down, up, down, 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 up. Now, you know what make a nice picking exercise is just those two beats, beats three and four, repeated over and over again. Watch. I think it makes a pretty cool lick. Sounds like a Led Zeppelin or something. Okay, cool. So that's the picking. That's uh, fine point number one. Okay, fine point number two might be the idea of like practicing this tune using a lot of muted strumming. You know, the way Hendrix did it, the way Stevie Ray Vaughan did it. So watch this. Now, I can kind of hear the tune in this, right? Now, I'm just messing with this. Now, when you're doing this technique, one of the things is you kind of want to try to sound like a drummer. You know, something like that. Also, keep your right hand loose and your pick kind of really, really loosely held. You know. Okay, lots of fun stuff to exercise around on with this. It's great lick, buddy guy. What kind of woman is this? Till next time.